I hate this thing, dude. Look how weird he is. Dogether? Dogether? I don't know. I don't like anything about him. I don't like his attacks. I don't like his profile. I don't like his death animation. I don't like his symbol thing. There's literally nothing about that enemy that I like. Not even his bestiary entry. Number 66? That's one too many sixes for me. <laughs> oh, here we go. We got it. Amanita. Get out of here. He teleports too. He's red. He's so wrinkly. He's got an eye. His freaking teeth. The noises he makes. Literally nothing redeeming. <laughs> Legs made of silver. Like he maybe he might drop something that that, you know, is acceptable, but I have no idea what it is. And you're crazy if you think I'm farming that ugly thing. For the sake of curiosity. Man-eating plants. Oh, these guys drop something too. Only two star. I'll give it a try, but I think technically I've been getting pretty lucky on my drops. So I don't know if like my my drop rate my drop rate luck ratio is bound to be spent soon. Silver plate? Sure. I guess we're just putting Jonathan in fat armor. It's alright, no fat rolling here. This is a good spot to farm him. Oh, he dropped it! Rose Stem Whip. Yeah, new whip. That requires great skill to use, or, good thing I'm Jonathan, I can just use the whips. I forget, I need to use this holy water as much as I can if I want to upgrade it. And not using it is not going to help. Witches are actually susceptible, or actually, I mean, um, strong against light damage. It's weird. Yeah, that's absolutely not what I would expect. Uh, hmm. Nope, you're good. But she's not strong against thorns. Great. The birds. So yeah. It, it is um the more the more you hit things with your sub weapon the more they'll level up Charlotte help me push this so strong it's dark a lot of frogs why did it have to be frogs? There's a room up there, but I can't get to it. A lot of thousand year eggs. Now, I know that's a real dish, thousand year egg. Um, 
I don't remember how it's made. It was, it was it's kind of a strange dish, if I recall. I'm also not sure where it gets its name. Stonewall, a defensive stance passed down by the Morris family. It's a pretty garbage move, Mr. Morris. I gotta say. I missed that second one. Because of you. Ah. No, oh, there's spores. Well, Charlotte's gone because I'm all out of the MP. And what little I have left, I'm gonna use on on the holy water. Eh. Like that. Okay. It's alright, Charlotte can come back now. Yeah, get out of here. Yeah! Time for another boss. I don't like this boss. Um, I don't even know what's good to use against him. Walk a knife? No, it wouldn't be that. Uh, maybe the Bible. Charlotte, I don't even think you're gonna be part of this fight, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> How's this for an enemy? Question mark indeed. Yeah, really the main thing, the main attack to watch out for in this fight is that. Yeah, his only weak spot is the head. You know, good old Dracula style. His belly also counts as a guard, but, you know, whips just kind of overlook that entirely. Kind of another impatient boss fight. If you if you're a little too early in trying to whip his head, you'll get hit by the water stream. And he's already dead, man. What a loser. <laughs> oh yeah. Toad morph, a shape-shifting spell that turns the caster into a frog. Ooh. right it's frog time here we go yeah <laughs> we're a frog and she's got a little book on her back little tongue. It's strictly a progression skill. <laughs> the, trust me, there's nothing weak against frogs. Um, let me think here. Uh, so this opened up, I know which path this opened up, but it also opened up something else. And let's go ahead and get that something else. Back in here. Wahoo! Um... Yeah, over here. Oh yeah, I do not miss these ghosts. That's for heckin' sure. Ooh. 
Ooh! Thank you for being destroyed there. Even though I still got hit by something, I could have gotten hit by worse. Ow! No, why, why am I using that? Oh, because of the boss. That's right, I never even used it anyway. Get rid of the dragon. Right here. Now we can fit in here. Jonathan's a red frog. Sanctuary. An advanced spell that cures status abnormalities for all within range. Look at this frog simulator. So yeah, Sanctuary. It's basically just a very... A very expensive... Um, status heal. Like, if you're cursed or if you're poisoned. Well, I mean, if you're cursed, you'd have to cast it pretty fast. Because it does use MP. But, like, if you're poisoned... Basically, if you're poisoned, you know, it's, it's a cure for that. It's not a heal. It's, it's, just, a, it's just a status cure. Get out of here. Oh my, how is this thing not dead? He's got no arms. Apparently he's got no brain either. Oh, glasses. <laughs> the skull chop glasses, what the heck? But yeah, it's a very, it's a very unique skill in that, I guess I should use it. It's a very unique skill in that it takes a long time to cast. Look at that speed. So, it's it's not going to be a very useful skill. Or is it? Um, we're still going to need toad toad morph. I was going to say toad morph. There's no docks here. And what's up, Doc? Alright, so we got some quests we can turn into wind. Well, we have a quest we can turn into wind. Boy, is it windy in here, or is it just you? You learned a purification spell? Yes, now I can break the vampires' curse. Indeed, you can. But if they become full vampires, it will be too late. We won't know if it's too late until we try. Yes, that's true. Still, even if you break the curse, please do not tell them about me. Why not? I'm sure that they both want to see you. My daughters think that I'm dead. The truth is, my body is gone. Besides, Bronner comes first. But still, it's all right. It's the fate of my family. My daughters have a task they must perform. If I can see them one last time before I pass away, that's good enough for me. Okay, I gotcha. Let's get going, but let's hurry. We have three people to meet. You're right. So yeah, we can use Sanctuary to um, cure his daughters. We can. And you know what? That's pretty true. <laughs> that is the Lacard fate, because they never show up in a Castlevania game ever again. That's not saying much, as they haven't made many Castlevania games after this period. But technically, it's true. Assassin Blade. Defeat a total of 1,500 enemies. Okay. Collect five cards. Uh, I don't I don't remember that five cards uh, okay how many cards do I have um 
use item? I would imagine... I have no idea how many cards I have. 1500, I'm about four, I'm less than 400 away. Okay. But yeah, we got Assassin Blade, which is a pretty good weapon. It's not as strong, but it's a poison blade. It looks cool. 